Well, police say when the suspects first came to the front door of this building this morning, they just started ringing all the apartments until someone buzzed them inside. Then they knocked on the first door they saw claiming to be delivery men. Tonight, in an exclusive interview, the victim told me that he didn't think he had any reason to doubt them until he opened the door. Mohibul Islam feels like life gave him a second chance. The 53 year old father thought he was going to die after opening his 24th Street apartment door for two men who said they were UPS workers. I asked, Who is this? He said, UPS. And I, when I opened the door, he pushed the door, he came in. And he put the gun in my head and said, I'm going to shoot him. Police say the suspect hit Islam in the head with the gun, then shot him in the leg. And then my mom ran out of my uh, ran out of the bed and she she ran out of the door and then she went to like the okay, third floor and they called 911. Islam's 10-year-old son was at school while this was happening around 10 a.m. Thursday morning, but relays his mother's experience since she is too distraught to say much about it. So you were home with them when this happened? Mm-hmm. Oh, can you tell me what you heard? Uh -huh, I'm hot, I'm not. Okay. Police say the suspects dropped what turned out to be empty boxes they had brought with them as props, leaving Islam to bleed on the hallway floor until an ambulance arrived. Did they steal anything? No. So why would anyone want to do that? I don't know. He don't take anything. He don't ask nothing. And police say they are reviewing surveillance images of the suspects who they believe drove away in a car with a Connecticut license plate. Tonight, Islam is spending the night in the hospital awaiting surgery. We're live in Astoria, Queens. Allie Bauman, TV 1055. All right, Allie, thanks very much.